Well, well, well. Look who's back for more Roblox mayhem. Today, we're diving into Dress to Impress, the Halloween update. And we're doing the challenge where we can only use the new spooky items. You know, the ones that don't make you look like a rejected site dish at the cookout. Speaking of disasters, shout out to the geniuses who ruined the hot dog costume for everyone, because apparently, dressing up like a snack was too much temptation for some of you weirdos. Now it's gone. Forever. Rest in peace, wiener warriors. Anyways, stick around as I serve some real looks without violating any community guidelines. Let's go. The developers ate so hard with this update, guys. Like, seriously, they put their whole Delavushy into this. Like, seriously, it's so good. Anyway, you guys know what challenge we're doing today. Let's hope we eat down. Obviously, I always do, but sometimes these little roaches, rodents in these servers just don't understand that art is before them. I'm thinking I'm going with like a blue, purple goddess look. Honestly, I'm not sure what the fuck I'm going for. I'm just going with the flow. And whatever pops into my brain, I'm just gonna do it. These sleeves over here are literally my new favorite thing. I feel like they're gonna fit so well with some of the ladies in my Wrong Women series. And yes guys, I am continuing that. I've gotten comments on my TikTok asking if I'm still continuing that series, and I am. Trust me. I just have to put a lot of research into these ladies and I don't want to just include people without actually knowing what they're about. So just let me research them and I will definitely be coming up with more videos. I saw people layer these horns with like the antlers so I'm definitely going to be doing that. And I've never used this little red set over here so I'm thinking that could be nice and I kind of hate the skirt. I think I hate the skirt. When I played with the update for the first time and I saw this feature of the dressing room, I was excited, but then I was also upset because all the codes are here so it's like super difficult and I have to go like back and forth, back and forth from the lashes or shit. But besides that, I actually really like it. I think it's a super cool feature and with all like the hard work they put into this, I think we all should not be complaining this hard about the update. I think it's just because it's new and we're not used to it because everyone was complaining about the brat update and then everyone loved it. So we just need to wait and see. I think everyone will get super used to it and it'll be amazing. Also, the new hairs they added, oh my god I'm in love. I'm so in love. They added so many hairs and they're so good and like I was saying in my other video, I love the highlights that they add. That is so amazing, like I'm literally shitting my pants right now, I'm so excited. Also, all the fucking new makeup that was added, oh my god, they ate, they eat so fucking hard, bro. Like, I can't even explain it. Like, I'm so happy. Do you see the face that I'm making right now? Cunty, cunty, screaming cunt. When is the faces I've never made not screamed cunt? Oh, oh, if you guys could see me right now, I'm literally doing a little jig. I will, like, insert something of resembling the jig I'm doing. I'm coming over here and I'm gonna take a look at this fucking free moon gazer skirt. Did I just waste my fucking like 150 fucking robux? Why do you guys get a free version? I mean, fuck, whatever. Let me stop complaining. It's fucking Roblox. It's a literal video game. Is it that serious? Yeah, it is that serious. It is that serious. Oh, she's giving like bubblegum princess fairy like in the best possible way. One star. I don't know why, but she's kind of giving me crimson pink. And girl, with all these options, you chose that. I just don't like the dress. I don't like the bottom. I don't... I don't think it goes, but she is definitely giving me crimson pink right now. When Behold, the embodiment of ethereal grace, or as I like to call it, I woke up like this. Literally, look at me. I'm the pastel goddess you never knew you needed, but definitely don't deserve. Light pink? Check. Light purple? Oh, you bet. I'm out here serving you heavenly vibes, while the rest of you are struggling to look like you didn't get dressed in the dark. 
Oh, yes, go girl. There was absolutely nothing. You put on three items and called it a day? This isn't an outfit. You just wore clothes. She literally asked what the theme meant in the chat. Like, there isn't a button that will tell us what the theme is now. How did we get here? Now. Walk a mile in these Louboutins. If I didn't place, I'm gonna scream. Look at that, I got third place. I'm not gonna say thank you in chat because first of all, I deserved first place. Come on now, let's, let's be for real. Come on guys. Voting needs to be better. Let's get on our shit, bitches. The theme is hot mess and I figured why not challenge myself because I hate this theme and oh look at that, I can't change my skin tone. Well, may as well leave it this color that is a hot mess in itself, I guess being blue yeah i have no idea what i want to do with this outfit there's actually no idea in my head nothing is coming to mind i'm just slowly going off of vibes and the vibes are telling me to take off these fucking cat heads thanks no it's not good i have yet to use the little birdie so let's do that because it doesn't go with the outfit and anything that doesn't go with the outfit is the perfect addition to it. When I think hot mess, I'm not talking runway fabulous, no. We're going a full, I just rolled out of bed and slapped on whatever was closest and my face looks like I lost a fight with a wand mower. Nailed it. I've been rocking this smurf look all around because the tanning machine decided to glitch out, leaving me looking like I swam in a vat of blueberry juice. But guess what, mid round miracle, the game decided to fix itself. I mean, don't get me wrong, the blue was a vibe and all, but now I can go back to my regular shade of didn't sleep for three days, but pretending to still function. Progress. Oh, look at this. Someone didn't get the memo. The theme is hot mess. Not I'm trying too hard to be adorable. One star, because if you're not giving off just woke up in a dumpster fire energy, you're doing it wrong. Sorry. It's cute and everything, but embrace the chaos, baby. Come on. All right, folks, embrace yourself. This outfit, absolute trash. I'm talking dumpster behind a fast food joint at 3 a.m. bad, but that's exactly what the theme calls for. So if I don't get five stars for this glorious train wreck, I'm calling bullshit. Seriously, this outfit is so fucking bad, it's basically art. You're welcome for blessing your eyes. Oh, well, if it isn't the human highlighter, Neon green everything topped off with a tutu and pink hot shoes. Okay, she's practically glowing and I mean in the worst way possible. I mean, yeah, it's definitely a hot mess, so points for fucking accuracy, but let's be honest, uh, it's also just ugly. What the fuck is this? She's like me after eating one too many tacos, I'm bleeding out my asshole. Why is there blood on her ass? If I don't win this round, I'm gonna scream. All right, new round, fresh start, and no, we're not gonna talk about how I rage quit the last game because everyone didn't think my dumpster fire fucking masterpiece outfit didn't deserve first place. Moving on, the theme is musicals, and guess what? We're going full on cats. Yeah, the one that scarred us and made us question fucking humanity because it looked so fucking stupid. Yeah, those CGI fucked up ass cats, those cats. Some of you may be asking why Everyone hated cats, even though I literally just said why. That mitt was that not reason enough for you? It was fucked up. That was it. It was fucked up. It looked weird. And we're about to look weird. So let's just embrace it, bitch. Why do I feel like I'm giving slutty kitty right now? I'm not mad, okay? I'm not mad about it at all. But I think I think we look a little slutty, guys. I don't know. Okay, let's talk about this face I'm making in the makeup chair because it's about to fucking eat down, okay? I mean, this is custom makeup, so it's gonna be good no matter what. It could literally make a fucking potato look like a supermodel, okay? Look at me, I'm serving fucking face. Everyone is gonna be shook, I'm serving body, body. Look at the contour, look at the lashes. Amazing, amazing. And now we're taking it up with the fucking kitten whiskers because who said you can't look cute and fierce? This is next level, it also eats. I mean, I'm basically unstoppable at this point. Like, it's amazing. All my outfit decisions 
are top tier. You wouldn't know. At all. But this top, this top is fucking tragic. I, no, I don't like it. And now I'm out of fucking time. Oh my. How does a bastard, orphan, son of a whore and a Scotsman, dropped in the middle of a forgotten spot in the Caribbean by providence, impoverished and squalor, grow up to be a hero and a scholar? The Oh well, look who decided to join in the Sharpay and her brother! Straight out of the high school musical. Oh my gosh. And let me tell you, their outfits eat harder than a buffet on a cheat day. I don't care. Five stars. I don't know why I became Southern, but I am. Alright folks, get ready for my victory speech because this is unlocked. I mean, the theme is, what the fuck do you mean I didn't win? This is fucking outrageous. The only person who deserved to win this was Hamilton and me, but mostly me. I mean, seriously, this thing is fucking rigged. Lin-Manuel Miranda, I demand a fucking recount right now. Get down here, get down here. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. It was so fun to film this today. I love doing this. I hope to do more Halloween videos before, you know, Halloween actually hits, but we'll see. See you guys next time. Mm -hmm.